thank you everybody for tuning in. Uh, this is the final on the Ford Focus Rally car. Uh, kit is by Hasegawa. It uh, has a couple of uh, stumblings that I'm not the most happy with. Um, and it mainly comes down into my decals. Whether I went too fast, whether the decals were too old, uh, whether I didn't have enough of a relief cut in them to where they were going to work. Uh, quite a few possibilities on all of that. Um, all in all, it turned out to be a pretty good car. The kit that I had was an open box and it was missing the headlight lenses. So I filled those in with liquid resin. That wasn't anything that was anything too crazy. Uh, the decals went on good for the most part. If they were single decals, it was a full jacket decals that I, I struggled with. In hindsight, it probably would have been better to mask and tape the orange and the blue lines and then just use the uh, sponsor logos which those came off really simple and really nice so um things to to learn things to take on to the next one for sure um i needed to uh increase my my decal game and this was one of the kits that i i had no real attachment to so i could just build a box stock and really kind of play with the decals and uh learn so uh that's what uh what I did with it, um, it, is, it has a 1K clear over the decals just to basically seal them onto the body. I had hopes of going through and doing some, some dusting as if it was driven on a, a dirt road as this car is a winning car and that is the, the rally that it won. Um, but the decals I'm just not happy with at all on it and I didn't want to just use the weathering as a cover up on the on the the failing on that but it's a completed build and that's always a good thing to have uh having the bench or having the the display shelf uh there are a couple of things that I did omit on it um mainly being the uh kit supplied uh, seat belts I my fingers just don't have that uh, that in it or I haven't practiced enough to where I can make that work with those and I did not put the uh, mud guards on either it doesn't match the the other cars that I have of this era in rally in my display case so I wanted them to all kind of make sense that way so thank you guys for watching just a quick little uh, uh, a final on this, and uh, I will put together a full video of the full build and speed it all up uh, the way that I did with the uh, Camaro when I did it. And uh, you can see all the, the steps that I did, and then I can expand more on specific parts of the build that I liked or didn't like as it went. Uh, overall, I would recommend this build as the kit is a great build. Decals uh, were past my skill level, um, so I, I can't recommend on that side, but it is a good kit. It went together really well, especially if you're going to build the rally winning car. Thank you guys for watching. We'll see you next time.